Jesus, I'm glad to be out of there. Mr. and Mrs. Black don't seem to have the happiest home life. He's too scared to divorce her, and she's too much of a shrinking violet to throw him out. If this hadn't happened, they could have stayed miserable together forever. You think she could have killed him? She sure as hell doesn't seem the type. But stranger things have happened. Okay, so, you know, maybe. Hey, I know you. No, you don't. Everybody knows me. I'm famous. We were at school together. Uh, how about you buy me a drink? For, for old time's sake. Hell nah, cuz. <laughs> I thought he was gonna say you're famous because you've been breaking cases. And he did that cheese. You looking for someone? I definitely am. Fruit beers all around, doll. You know Frank Morgan? Sure. Frank's your regular. He's a loner in the back. He's the loner in the back. All right, well. Father hates him. Frank Morgan? I don't know what to do. Who's asking? Who's asking? It's this guy right here. What's up, cuh? Cole Phelps, LAPD. I understand you're a friend of Adrian Black. Yeah, I know him. Are you aware that he's missing? No, I hadn't heard that. Tough break. Oh, hell no. This dude is lying. Ha, <laughs> ha, the way that he just said tough break, that man didn't care at all about that. He said it even almost with the smirk right to our face. Let me just see what our evidence is just so that we know what we can talk. Because I already I, I can already tell he's going to be a problem. So we got the water heater, the flyer, the glasses. You know, you just got to remember this stuff depending on what the question is going to be Link to the abandoned vehicle. So here we go. And actually, wait. Abandoned vehicle. So we have the blood. We have the... Oh, yeah. We do have the receipt for the hog. No no idea what's going on well, with that. Well, it's all the same to you, I'll go back to my drink. All right. We'll go ahead and talk to him now. Let's do it. Link to the abandoned vehicle. We found Black's car abandoned in a freight depot covered in blood. You know anything about that, Morgan? Hell no. Uh, I'm, I'm sorry to hear that. I like Adrian. He... He's a good no, boss. Please, don't tell me you actually believe this jerk off, Phelps. This guy is a terrible actor. <laughs> Look at that man's face. What, what's that man doing, cuz? Oh, oh, man, he is insulting us. He's making faces. Sheesh. We got to hit that. We got to accuse that. He, hell, Naka, we accusing. You're lying, Morgan. You were there. And you're talking out your ass, detective. How about you prove I was out at that rail yard? Ooh, we got to prove that he was out there at the rail yard. Now, that's the only question. How, how the hell do we prove that? Ah. So we know there's bloody, but that's not going to prove that he was there. Oh, wait a second. Okay, right there, F. Morgan. Right there, it says F. Morgan. And let's make sure there's nothing else. Railroad tracks, large splashes. Okay, that one does say F Morgan. And that's how we found out it was Frank because the wife said who it was. So it's the receipt, baby. Why Why you got the receipt right there at the scene, cuh? You acting like you weren't there. You got the receipt right there, baby. Let's get it. I thought cops had their own bars. You were there, Morgan. We found a receipt in the trunk of the car. It has your name on it. We can call the slaughter yard and nail you on. All right, already. That fool Adrian's falling for some dame in Seattle. He wanted me to make it look like he'd been attacked. Oh, it's a fake. That's tough. So he did that to give the other guy an alibi so he could go make a splash and cheat. <laughs> oh, man, that's hilarious. Yo, that is hilarious. You, you know that, that that really doesn't make any sense. If you need to skip out of town, you ain't got to do all that. You could just say you're signing a deal, right? That's what a guy would do. A guy would say, hey, we about to sign a new deal. Got to go up there, you know, treat the client right so we can get him to sign on the dotted line. You ain't got to do all of that. 
Where exactly is Black holed up? No idea. I think he took off for Seattle. Okay, come on, cuz. You know you know where he's at. You know you know where he's at. Because we have the train ticket, but I don't think the train ticket or whatever ticket, I don't think that's enough proof because it doesn't say where he's going. Hmm. I guess I guess we'll just do the uh, the bad cop because we were, we've already stunted this guy one time. Maybe he'll maybe he'll say something if I say bad. Because if I accuse, because we already know that he went. I don't know. I think I think bad cop might be what you need. So we'll go bad cop. We'll try that because I don't think accuse is gonna work again. Because I don't know what to accuse with. I'm tired of your shtick, Morgan. Spill it, or we take you out in the alley and we knock it out of you. He's holed up at my place. He's waiting for some money to come through before he blows town. An address? It's an apartment house at the corner of Temple and Figueroa. Apartment number two. Wow. I think that's all. Thanks for your help, Morgan. We appreciate it. Hey, I'm just glad I could help. I love cops. Cuff him, let him go. It's up to you, Phelps. There's no way I'm writing this idiot up. That was easy work. Or let him off by leaving the bar. Ooh, so should we arrest right. that man? Or should we let him leave? That's a good a question. You're getting nothing more from me. Wow, should we arrest? They gave me an option to arrest that man. Book him. All right, we're going to arrest him. Let's arrest him. We're taking him in. <laughs> oh, man. Pack him up. You got Morgan's address? Let's get over to his apartment. Pack him up. High IQ move. Let me play to pack him up. So let's do it. Let's go catch this guy. I can't believe that he did this whole elaborate plot just to go and make it splash. Right? Just go to the club, cuh. Just go to the strip club, cuh. I've met some pretty good liars in my time. People who sound convincing because they actually believe their own bullshit. <laughs> the type is clever. Hard to catch out. Frank Morgan is not one of those people. No, he is not. Tell that man to just go to the club, cuh. 11K, go ahead. Message from technical services. One found in the abandoned Lincoln at the PE freight depot is not human. Repeat, not human. Compositional analysis reveals swine as the most likely man. Roger, KGPL. Time to reel this guy in, Phelps. All right, so let's go get this guy. I guess he's going to run, right? Oh, we're not even looking out for traffic. I don't want to run anybody over. And look at this city. We're just driving through it. And here it is. Oh, wait, we're on the wrong side of the road. Oh, ho, ho. That's not how you do it. Oh, wait, it says to go down. Oh, never mind. It's right here. I think they said apartment two, too, right? Apartment number two. Well, let's check the place out. Come on. Okay, and this is rumbling, so it must be this. And Morgan is number two. I thought that's what he said. He apartment said two. two. And it's funny because I think the first apartment we went to was also two. So what if in this game, everybody is, is in apartment two? That would be some cheese. So let's do it. Can't believe this guy did all of that just to escape the wife. And here goes apartment number two. Help you gentlemen? LAPD detectives, Mr. Black. You're under arrest. Look, I'm really sorry about this. I never tried to hurt anyone. I just needed to get away from LA. I won't put up a struggle. Just let me get my things. Hell no. Nah. Don't let him get his things. Do it. Phelps, go after him. I'll try and hit go him. Go get him. Oh, where'd he go? Remember, the gun is the last resort. Did he go up here? I didn't even see it. There's no point running, Avery. I just ran. Okay, he did go up here. I just ran. I didn't even see him go out there. 
Hey, we're letting it fly, baby. Wow. Mr. Black, get back here right now. He just turned on the jets. Did they get him? Stop right there, Adrian. It's over, Adrian. Oh, the backup got him. My partner got him. Why not just come clean with her, Black? Why the melodrama? I thought it would be easier. No, it just got a whole lot harder. Adrian Black, you're under arrest for conspiracy and fraud. We'll see what the DA has to say about wasting police resources on a wild goose chase like this. You're going to lose your wife, lose your job, and probably end up in the big house. I hope she was worth it, Adrian. And she definitely wasn't worth it. That man made a new move. Wow. That turned out to be quite some case, huh? Adrian, what an idiot. You got an arrest and a clearance in your first case, and in fine style, too. Well done, detective. Efficient investigation technique, good public presence. You keep that up, and you learn from Bukowski here, and you could go a long way in this department. Nice, we're getting a trophy for that episode right there. The driver's seat. City damage. Vehicle damage was $29. Ir injuries are $0. Adrian Black can look forward to his day in court and a beating from the LA press. 12 of 12 questions correct. 14 of 14 clues found. Not bad at all. But we're doing more car work. Okay, we're going to keep this short. I'm already late for the DA. First up, Phelps, Bukowski. We got a report of a brand new Packard abandoned in an empty lot off 2nd Street between Olive and Grand. PR is one Oswald Jacobs says the vehicle was dumped in his backyard. There's a patrolman on site. Get down there and see what you can turn up. Any questions? Good. Get going. That's easy work. So go to the backyard, an abandoned vehicle. Better go earn our pathetic wages. Better go do it. Rimsky, O'Halloran. Intelligence has information on a stolen car racket. All right, I guess he's not going to say any more activity. But let's make our way downstairs. An abandoned vehicle. We catch all the good ones, huh, Phelps? Sounds like there's more to it than that. Nobody dumps a shiny new Packard unless they borrowed it without asking. You don't say. You're on fire today, Einstein. Very funny. Come on, my intense protege. Let's go save the world. You hear about Adrian? Prod in Seattle threw him out. Wife says she's gonna take him back. Women generally show more compassion. What are you talking about? Adrian dumped on her. He was humping the secretary. Margaret should show some pride. Pride comes before a fall, Mikowski. I'm talking from experience. Oh, we took another hit, so we're gonna our report is gonna be all messed up. Vehicle damage. Phelps, traffic. I'm Officer Houlihan. Cars down the alleyway, detectives. We got a call about an abandoned vehicle? Yes, sir. The car has flags. Might be some kind of diplomatic vehicle. Has anyone touched this vehicle since you arrived? No. And that Jacob's bird over there was on station before I got here. We'll talk with him in a moment. Give us some time to look the place over. Sure, take your time. He's a sore-headed old son of a bitch anyway. Let's get it. And we got something flashing over there. Look at that. Something on the floor is flashing, so we'll check that out in a second. All right, so what is this? We'll have to use the registration to trace the owner. So they've got the license plate in the front. Some states do put it on the front, but I guess it's not on the back? Okay. So then we have the door here. And it, it wants, it's shaking in the back too, so maybe the trunk will work. Let's check this. It's owned by the Argentinian Embassy. 
But we're getting crazy out here. And then back here, something is tripping. Empty. Empty trunk. And then there is a wheel missing on some bricks. Look at that cheese. Stealing the Look at the feet. Oh, it's a perfect. It's a perfect placement. That is the best free throw line dunk yet. I'm not on the line. That was beautiful. <laughs> Off vert. No dribble. Just caught it and went. Just caught it and let it fly. 